Hi, in this video I'm going to be doing a review of Niches. It's an AI writer. The very first thing when you log in, you'll see this interface along with this dashboard. You have a uh, you know different things on the left hand side and then you have a whole bunch of different custom contents that you can use uh, start a start marketing plan blog short posts ads image posts feedback emails YouTube products career sales pin pinboard type post uh, you can do code SEO questions books poetry courses dialogues and real estate so I'm gonna go ahead and, and show a few of the features. I'm not gonna go everything, but let's go over YouTube. And uh, let's see, it says choose things you want to be part of your plan. So you can go ahead and pick different types of content. You can do a video outline. So I'll you know, break down what you should talk about, random video ideas, opening line, keywords to video title. I'm gonna do um, I'm gonna do random video ideas because that's that's. A common thing, all right. So my channel name is Digital Nomad Institute. Uh, I want to talk about affiliate marketing, and we show people how to make money online using real methods. Okay. And then I'm gonna go generate. Right. I did this before to test it out, and I'm gonna show you this one right here. Okay. So then it has for your. Uh, this is for YouTube. Let me go back. Here we go. YouTube. All right. How to use an iPhone to make money on the go. How to make money as a HYIP affiliate. Um, how to make $100 per day selling on Amazon. $70 worth of products from AliExpress. Actually, these aren't too bad. These are kind of like mixed titles but they're not too bad right? they just give you different ideas um, you know it, it does kind of help out but uh, it's kind of limited you have to go ahead and do it again every every four you know times you just can't click on add more because then you have to now go ahead click here and then go and do this again enter this again and then generate more now and then you have to wait 60 seconds it's going to say it's done and then you have to hit refresh and here are, are four more so we stopped at here the ultimate guide to building a Shopify store how to make online money online using spirituality spirituality the five-step formula to becoming a digital nomad uh, how to make money online using affiliate marketing all right these aren't too bad let me just do one more time just to you know do a in-depth review let's see because this is quite popular I know a lot of people including myself are stuck when it comes to video ideas all right so I wait 60 seconds it says it's done and then I have to click refresh all right so here how to make money online using affiliate marketing how to earn money on an island <laughs> my 100k challenge interview with a real u.s air force veteran ah this is a bit you know doesn't make sense how i make a five-figure income working from home self-employed right, these are all pretty decent titles for the most part except for one or two all right but you can see the the idea generated is not not that bad uh, i can try something else let me see i'm gonna go ahead and do random video ideas again Let's do email marketing. Right. Um, how to start email marketing. Right. And then generate ideas. See what comes up. Wait 60 seconds. It's good to go. Refresh. All right. How to start email marketing. Uh, email marketing tips for beginners, how to grow an email list from nothing, how to start email marketing. Now this is the same as this one. All right, let me go one more time. Generate now. Wait 60 seconds. 
Good to go. Hit the refresh button. Okay. Email list building explain how to start email marketing. Email marketing 101 for beginners. Okay. Um, you know, it's some repeats, but all in all, not too bad. So that's the idea generator for YouTube. Not bad. I'd say it's it's okay. It's not great, but it, it's it's okay. It's decent. Um, let me go to the dashboard again. And I'm going to show you the blog tool. Now, the other type of content that people like to talk about is the blog tool. And they, they want to generate posts quickly. I know I, I do if I have a blog. So then you can go ahead. I'm going to show you real quick how you can generate a, a pretty quick blog using this blog tool. Let me see. Okay, so first you would go down to blog post outline. Uh, I'm going to type in email marketing. This is my company name. Uh, my blog is about how to start email marketing for beginners. For... Um, let's see. Ah, let's, let's just leave it at that. Step by step guide to email marketing. All right, and then I click generate. It's going to give an outline. Okay, right here. I view the plan. And here, here it is. This is like several variations. So the first one is step-by-step -step guide to email marketing. What is email marketing? How to create a list? Uh, how to spend your first campaign? How to send your first campaign? How to follow up with your subscribers? And then the other one, variation: What is email marketing? Advantages, best practices, tool to use. All right. And then the other one: Create an email chip account. Create a MailChimp template. Create subscription forms, create email content, draft your first email. All right, so let's go with uh, let's go number number two. All right, so I'm gonna take this one right here, copy it, Control C, and then I'm just gonna go to add more. I'm going to add in, uh, let's see, blog intro. And then I'm going to type in this post right here, this post right here, generate now, let it run for 60 seconds, and then refresh. So then I got email marketing. What is email marketing? Email marketing is the most effective form of marketing available to a small business or enterprise. But did you know that it costs nothing to send out a few emails? The truth is email marketing is a free and effective way to increase your lead, build your brand, and increase your traffic. All right, and the other one's a bit longer. Email marketing is a proven and cost-effective way to grow your business as it allows you to reach your customers when it, wherever they are. But email marketing isn't just for businesses. It's great for individuals, too. You can use it to build your personal brand and find new followers. You can use it to sell products and services or to promote your blog. What's more, you can use email marketing to stay in touch with your friends and family. Uh, I'm going to go with the first one. Copy it and add it into here. Then I'm going to go into the next section. Let's see. And I'm going to have to add more, but let's see. Go back to intro. And just add a bit more to clarify advantages of, oops, of email marketing. Okay. I'm going to add that in. Add that in here. Generate more. Okay, and then hit the refresh button. Now you have the second part. Advantages of email marketing. Email marketing provides big benefits for businesses. You can send out emails to your customers and prospects while they're online, and they'll be able to read and reply just 
as they would on a social media platform. Email marketing helps you engage your audience without using social media, and it prom uh, promotes brand awareness and increased sales. Um, email marketing has become the preferred way to reach customers and prospects. More people are using email marketing to deliver their value proposition to customers and prospects. Email marketing has become such a critical channel of communication in today's digital world. I'm gonna go with the I'm gonna go with the first one. All right. So copy this. And then you know what? I might as well just add oops. Might as well just add the titles. Get this one here. Okay, so then we go on to the third part. Let me just go down here. Best practices. So I just go up to add more. Go down to blog post intro. And then just add it into what the blog is about. Nope. Okay, copy this over here. And then generate. Give it a second. And then I guess hit refresh. All right, so best practices for email marketing. Email marketing is a powerful tool that can help you reach your audiences and increase conversion rates. Conversions, it's a simple concept, but there are cert certain practices practices that can help you increase your email deliver de deliverability and make your email marketing stand out. Uh, Okay, so I'm just gonna go go ahead and click this one, add it into here. Add this into here. And then the last one is tools to use All right, so we go to here go into blog plus intro All right, tools to use for email marketing and generate now refresh the page Okay, so tools to use for email marketing. Marketing emails are crucial for businesses since it is the best way to keep customers engaged and inform them about your business. The main goal of any email should be to grab attention, get the customer involved, and ultimately get them to click on a thank you link. However, sending an unsolicited email is not allowed by most major email clients. It is therefore essential that you send a personalized welcome and explain the benefits of subscribing to your newsletter. Okay, so I like this. I'll copy, oops, copy this. Add that into here. Copy this. Add that into here. All right, so just within the outline and the intro paragraphs, you're having roughly um about 250, 248 words, 250, 50 words. That's not too bad, uh, considering, you know, it only took me maybe, maybe 10 minutes to do everything here. Uh, if I, it would have been a lot quicker if I didn't have to explain everything. But that that's how you can generate a long form content. There is a, a long form editor. Um, if you go back to the dashboard, they have a long form editor here all the way down here like write a document 
and you can go ahead and you know, add a new document I don't know, test test save I guess I can take this now take this and add it into that and then from here you can go ahead and highlight stuff and click on this magic button and click auto generate and extend it from there right, same as here okay but it's a bit funky that's a problem I'm not sure if it if it's working properly or not so that's why I leave this off and I, I use the the other method of uh, going ahead and, and generating a blog post now let me go over real quick the pros and cons of what I found about niches the first thing is um, the user interface is a bit clunky you know like as you saw I had to click this then go outside and click a refresh button and then go ahead and copy this go back click another button re-enter in the, the outline it's not as drag and drop or uh, not as intuitive as writer is or the other AIs that I've reviewed um, on this channel the other thing is um, you can see some of the, the the titles and ideas that the YouTube generate gave it's kind of repetitive you know and that, that kind of adds more work on, on, on my end right so I have to go ahead and click another button and it's kinda of limited to only three or four ideas at one time now I haven't tried these other features yet so I can't really tell you much about them uh, but the other thing is the user interface is kind of like retro 80s I'm not sure if that's the the style that they're going for but it feels like an 80s website with these uh, with these color scheme it's a bit it's a bit hard to read at times um, and and you know these these things right here I wish there was a way to expand it out uh, maybe there is I haven't found it yet but it, it's a bit it's a bit hard to figure out what these are uh, let's see but overall I think it's a it's a decent AI writer okay I don't really look I don't put too much stock in the in the way it looks but I'm, I'm basically focusing on the output from the YouTube ideas tool as well as the blog um, generating content and from the thing that I do like is that there is no credit system um, if you purchase through the link in the description you can do a one-time purchase of this and you know you can go ahead and, and buy this and uh, you don't have to you know there's no credits you know you buy it, there's no credit system there's no monthly fees like most AI um, writers they, they they try to charge you a hundred dollars for unlimited publishing well you get unlimited publishing you get one-time fee at a, a decent decently reasonable price and the output is comparable it's better than the free AI writer that I showed earlier so that's good um, but compared to the, the premium premium and like um, AI writer such as writer it's not quite there right? it's not quite there but in a pinch and if you're starting off I would probably recommend this one um, if you can afford, if you had more money I would I would recommend uh, writer right uh, if you if you don't have enough then niche niches is probably you know the way to go because you only have to pay once I'm gonna leave a link in the description below so you can go ahead and check out and uh, I hope this video was helpful. And if, if it was, could you please hit that like button? I'm Vince from Digital No Menace Suit, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.